Hi guys and welcome to another Elementor video. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignDetectives.com. Well, we had a question, somebody's asking how in Elementor can you embed a playlist? It's very easy to embed just a regular video, uh, but they wanted to embed a whole playlist. Well it's pretty easy and of course the advantage of embedding a playlist is you play a video and when it gets to the end of the video it'll continue on and play the next video in the series. Thanks for watching. A great day. So when this one ends it should start up with the very next video in the series here. And there we go it's just carrying on there and this is from this particular playlist that we've got going on here and it's pretty easy I mean in embedding a regular video is no problem at all just go down and just put your embed code either in a text module in a, or in a code module or you've got a free video module with the free version of Elementor also there's the HTML code module and to do this today, that's what we'll use. We'll use the code module. If you enjoy this video today, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share and subscribe to the YouTube channel as it lets me know whether to make more videos on a particular subject. Okay, so let's go over to YouTube and I've got the playlist that I want to embed up here. And up the top here, you're going to see a big long number starting with PL at the top. Let's copy this and I'll put it in a little notepad over here. Okay, now what we need to do is go down and get the reg regular embed code. So if we go down and just share, hit the share button here, there we'll find an embed button. And there's the embed code. So I'm going to copy that with a little copy button down here. And again, I'm going to paste it in my little notepad here. Okay, and what we've got here, here's the actual URL of the video. YouTube embed. Now after the embed and forward slash there, we can get rid of the actual number of the video right there. And we need to replace it with a video series. So we say video series and I'll put this little bit of code down below the video question mark and then list equals and this is where we paste in our playlist code right here there it is right there okay now we've got this we can go back to our Elementor page and you can either use just a text editor. We'll put it in over here. You have to be on text version of it right here. And we can take our iframe code right here and paste it in. And there it is. Just make sure you're on text and not visual up there. And we've got our playlist embedded. And of course the other way, if I just remove this now, is to use the HTML, which is down the bottom, and it's still part of the free Elementor. And you can paste your iframe code in up there. Now let's just take a quick look, make sure it's gonna work. There it is right there, and it's exactly the same as the one next door, so pretty much sure it's gonna work. I'll just go ahead and hit play and let's scoot it right up to the end there. And there we are, it's starting to play the next video in the series, which is great. So that's how to embed a YouTube video playlist into your Elementor website, really easy. Okay, now what if you wanted it to auto play? Well, that's okay, we can just modify our code. So if we go back to our page, here's the playlist code, and just before that inverted comma that we put in up there, 
and I'll bring in my little text box and make it easier for you to see. Right after our playlist number right there and before the inverted comma, you can just add ampersand or the and sign and autoplay equals one. And that'll make it autoplay. So let's add that to our code making sure not to lop off the inverted commas there right after the playlist and as you can see it started playing it already great now sometimes it's a little bit annoying for hey guys, folks to have <laughs> like that this is to have noise over the top of a website when you first go to a page and so you might want to mute that and if you want to add a mute code, let's bring that little notepad back up again. Simply after the one of autoplay one, and again, I'll put all this below the video, ampersand, and then mute equals one. So let's copy our code and put it into our little box up there. Control C, make sure we don't lop off the inverted comma there. Paste it in. There we go, it's now playing on autoplay with no audio. Just make sure it's going to work on the front end. There we go. And it's playing and it will just continue playing through the whole playlist. So there you have it. There's how to embed a playlist on your site. And we've also given you the addition of having it muted and using autoplay. So I hope you've enjoyed this today and found it useful. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Once again, this has been Jamie from System22 and WebDesignerTechTips.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.